So I'm doing a Masters in Public Administration and that means that we look at the political administrative relationship and particularly we look at the policy process. So we follow how policy develops from start to finish and we look at all the different groups that interact with it like think tanks and NGOs and the media and also the institutions that shape it and that's on both the national and the international stage. I really wanted to study in a city where I'd get to see the practical application of what I was studying when all those groups like think tanks and NGOs would really come into focus and I really get to see what they were doing. But also I have to admit that, especially for someone trying to forge a career in governance, The Hague is one of those names that looks fantastic on your CV. So I think that's a, it's a name with gravitas and people really recognise that. There's just really nowhere like it in the world where you get that array of multicultural actors, at least that's what I think. <laughs> One of the ways for me as a student is it's all about dialogue. I get to meet people here from all over the world um, and have really multicultural experiences and that's both formally and informally. So I can go for drinks with my friends and probably I'll end up chatting to a researcher or a member of staff from an international organisation or from, some, from a ministry or something, but also Formally, I mean last year there was this fantastic week where I had a conference with the European Commissioner at the start of the week and a conference with Kofi Annan at the end of the week and it's opportunities like that which make The Hague this fantastic platform for building peace and justice. <laughs>